the cast of John Tucker Must Die, the beloved 2016 comedy, left a lasting impression on audiences with their memorable performances. As the film approaches its 18th anniversary, a big news was out that they will be having a sequel and fans are eager to know what has become of the talented ensemble. From Jesse Metcalf's ventures in television to Britney Snow's rise in Hollywood, each cast member has embarked on a unique journey since their time on screen. Hi, welcome to You Wanna Watch. And in this video, we will be talking about the John Tucker Must Die casts. What happened to them? Starting off at number eight, we have Jenny McCarthy. Jenny McCarthy, a well-known actress, host, and model when she starred in the film as Laurie Spencer. Over the years, she has hosted various shows including Dick Clark's New Year's Rockin' Eve, Love in the Wild, and The Jenny McCarthy Show and co-hosted The View for a year. She became a panelist on Fox's The Masked Singer in 2019. Jenny dated Jim Carrey from 2005 to 2010 and married Donnie Wahlberg in 2014. She is a mother to Evan, born in 2002 and diagnosed with autism in 2005. Number 7. Taylor Kitsch Before Taylor Kitsch portrayed Tim Riggins in the television series Friday Night Lights, he played Justin in the revenge comedy Chick Flick. Later on, he appeared in notable films such as X-Men Origins Wolverine, John Carter, and Savages. On television, he showcased his talent in series like True Detective, The Normal Heart, and Waco. In 2022, he played Ben Edwards on the Prime Video series The Terminal List. Number 6. Penn Badgley Before his breakout role as Dan Humphrey on Gossip Girl, Penn Badgley played Scott Tucker, John's brother, in the 2006 film John Tucker Must Die. Following this, he appeared in several films including Drive Through, Forever Strong, The Stepfather, Easy A, and Margin Call. He also had roles in Parts Per Billion, Cymbeline, and Guest Starred on The Slap. In 2018, he gained widespread recognition for his portrayal of the sinister Joe Goldberg in the Netflix thriller series You. In March 25, 2024, it was announced that the series has begun production on its fifth and final season. Number 5. Ariel Kebel She played the film's exemplary high school student Carrie Schieffer. Following the success of the film, she returned to the big screen in The Grudge 2 Freak Dog, The Uninvited, Vampires Suck, I Melt With You, Think Like a Man, and Fifty Shades Freed. She also continued her TV career, appearing in episodes of Life Unexpected, 90210, The Vampire Diaries, Unreal Ballers, The League, and 911. Ariel revealed details about the sequel to John Tucker Must Die in March 2024, confirming the original cast's involvement. She also hinted at interesting developments in the plot. Number 4. Ashanti Four years after she dropped her self-titled debut album, Ashanti joined the film as Heather Montgomery, one of John's women of the moment. Since then, she continued her on-screen acting career with Resident Evil Extinction and Army Wives, expanded to the stage with The Wiz, and dropped multiple studio albums. Between 2017 and 2018, she returned to the music scene, collaborating with several artists, including Ty Dolla Sign, Marshall Montano, Lil Wayne, and Mac Main. In 2024, the R&B singer announced her pregnancy with her rapper boyfriend, Nelly. This revelation followed their reconciliation in 2023, a decade after ending their decade-long relationship. We are nearing the end of our video, but before we proceed, we would like to ask you to please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel at www.youtube.com slash c slash you want to watch 2022 and follow us on our Facebook page at www.facebook.com. You want to watch any support you provide us will help us provide you with more and better content. Okay, now back to the story. Number 3. Sophia Bush Sophia Bush is renowned for her iconic TV roles as Brooke Davis in One Tree Hill and Aaron Lindsay in Chicago PD. Apart from these, she has been involved in numerous other projects and has dedicated herself to philanthropy and activism. In 2021, she launched the Drama Queens podcast alongside former One Tree Hill co-stars Bethany Joy Lentz and Hilary Burton. Throughout her career, her romantic life has garnered attention, including relationships with former co-stars James Lafferty, Austin Nichols, and Jesse Lee Soffer. Notably, she was briefly married to Chad Michael Murray for five months in 2005. She married Grant Hughes in June 2022 after becoming engaged in 2021. After 13 months of marriage, they decided to call it quits. She is currently dating soccer star Ashlyn Harris. Number 2. Brittany Snow 
After playing Kate Spencer in the teen rom-com film, Brittany Snow continued her film work with Hairspray, Finding Amanda, Prom Night, The Vicious Kind, and 96 Minutes. In 2012, she got the role of Chloe in Pitch Perfect, which she reprised in 2015 with Pitch Perfect 2 and again in 2017 with Pitch Perfect 3. She also appeared in Something Great X and other films. Brittany has also played major roles in television programs such as Ben and Kate, Full Circle, Crazy Ex-Girlfriend, and Almost Family. She married Tyler Staniland in March 2020. However, the couple announced their split two and a half years later. Finally, at number one, we have Jesse Metcalf. After his debut as John Tucker, Jesse Metcalf found more success on television than in films, with notable roles in Desperate Housewives, Chase, and Dallas. He ventured into Hallmark movies in 2015, leading to further opportunities. Metcalf starred as the lead in Chesapeake Shores, a series he also produced, from its premiere in 2016 until his departure in 2021. Additionally, he competed in season 29 of Dancing with the Stars in 2020, where he was eliminated in the fourth round. In his personal life, Jesse was in a 13-year relationship with Cara Santana, and they became engaged in 2016. However, they parted ways in 2020, after which he began a relationship with Corin Jamie Lee Clark. Despite this, Jesse didn't envision a long-term commitment with her, leading to his decision to end the relationship in December 2022. What do you think about our list? Who is your favorite character and or actor from John Tucker Must Die? Did we miss anything or anyone that you think should have been included? Let us know your thoughts by writing a comment on this video. If you're interested in our other videos, just hover over the videos and just press play. Until next time, watchers. Thank you for watching our video.